How to make alcohol in a post-apocalyptic world if you accidentally teleported there. <sighs> Great, you did it again. Press the wrong button, and now we're here. In a post-apocalyptic world. No Wi-Fi, no food, no people. Well, no normal people. Everything's broken, and honestly, there's nothing left to lose. So why not make some alcohol to feel a little less relaxed? Find anything sweet or full of carbs, fruit, old soda, rice, or that weird can of expired peaches you found under a collapsed gas station. Smash it up, pour it into something kind of clean. Jar, bottle, helmet, doesn't matter. Now add water, because science loves hydration. Next, find wild yeast. Where? It's floating in the air, on fruit skins, even on your dirty hands. Mix it in, cover the container with cloth, and wait. Two days if you want juice. A week if you want something that actually kicks. How does this work? Yeast eats sugar, sugar turns into alcohol, and alcohol turns into I don't care if the world's ended. That's science, baby. One sip, then the apocalypse suddenly feels less... <laughs> apocalyptic. Congrats, you've officially invented end-of-the-world happy hour. Try not to drink it all before sunrise.